Let's take a look at something that we talk a lot uh, here about on Cheddar. Uh, certainly for the past 18 months or so since the debut of ChatGPT, and that's artificial intelligence. Uh, well, in a conversation during a panel at the Salesforce World Tour Essentials in Singapore over the weekend, Lawrence Liu, that's the director of artificial intelligence at AI Singapore, said, quote, AI is not going to replace you. You're going to be replaced by someone who uses AI to outperform you, end quote. Uh, so similarly, the 2024 Microsoft Work Trends Index found that 71% of leaders say that they'd rather hire a less experienced candidate with AI skills than a more experienced candidate without them. Dave, thoughts? I know we talked a lot about this. Uh, you can share your thoughts and then I'll give you mine. Uh, it's scary. Look, if you're not on board, if you're not looking at your job as how can I use AI to help, you're going to fall behind. The problem is employers are not teaching their employees how to use it, but they are hiring based on it. So you're going to have to get up to speed. If you're in college right now, figure out what types of professions are going to be impacted by AI and factor that into what you're going to study because it will impact every industry on this planet, so you better figure right. it out. Right, obviously uh, every college out there, probably pretty much everyone does offer computer science, but I think only recently it was UPenn in the business school that offered specifically an AI course. I was able to interview that professor a, a few months ago actually, uh, but what those specific AI skills are, I think are still kind of getting crystallized, and I think that that will be interesting to see because you need to know how, how to work with it and, and what the skills you need to develop in order to be an attractive candidate in the workplace. I, I am a dinosaur when it comes to AI, so I need to get my training. <laughs> I need to go to UPenn and take that course.